Hi guys and welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to do an update for my subscription box Blitz collab. And I'm doing this with a bunch of ladies. Uh, Alexandra, Aura, Jamie, maybe Lindsay, I don't know. This is the seventh update, I believe. Eighth. The update for August. <laughs> I have finished one, two, three, four, five, six products this update. I'm so excited. And one of them I'm very excited about. Oh, two actually. Um, so I only have 20, only have 24 products left for this collab or project. And one of them I have considered, I have considered taking out of the project because it cause an effect for my eye and I don't want that anymore. So I don't know. So I will take a break from that. But I will talk about that when I get to the project. If you haven't followed along this project, it is basically a project based on the products that you have gotten from subscription boxes and stuff like that. It is makeup, skincare and so on. I'm very sorry about the noise from the cars. I can't help it. I need to film in this place. I will start off with my empties and I will start off with my makeup empties and yes I have some makeup empties and I'm so excited. So the first one is my Neutral Lux lip balm that I finally finished after seven months use and I'm so excited. This lasted forever and you didn't need much so that's why it went so slow. I usually only need to use these for two to three months but this took me seven so this will be a good investment and it smells like pineapple and so good. So I really like this product but I'm so glad it's done and so I can move on. I'm so excited about this product being gone. It is a lipstick. Guys, a lipstick. I finished off my lipstick. This is the Tease Cosmetics lipstick in East Side. It is a nude kind of color. A nude peachy pink color. I love this lipstick so much, but I'm very happy that it's gone because this is my third lipstick overall that I have finished. And if I sound a little funny, I'm I, I'm having a cold and this is just before I leave for my vacation, so yay me! <laughs> so I sniffle and stuff like that. Let's just move on. I have my shampoo, it is from Svarskov, it is the BC Bunny Cure Hair Therapy Oil Meal Cold Light Oil Shampoo thingy. This was a travel size, it didn't do that much for my hair, so I liked it but not enough to buy it again or something. Then I have my Unani Demo Defense Face Mask. I finally finished this one. Last time I was up to here, uh, or maybe further, maybe here, and I love this stuff a lot. I use this once or twice a week and I didn't break out or anything. I love this stuff. I used this for like five months maybe. Um, maybe one of the months I didn't use it as much, so Four months, I think, this last, if you use it continually. I finally finished this one. It is the Eurobus Sensitive Hand Cream. And I have had this in since the first update. Or oh, intro, maybe. So that is like six or seven months ago. I added this into the project and I just finished it a few days ago. Since last update, I didn't use it that much, but the last small bit that was in it here, I used some of it as a foot lotion for the night time, but I don't like foot lotion overall. <laughs> but it was done and it was a lovely hand cream, but I have so much more hand cream to go through, so no thank you. <laughs> then I have this Dushyam Akai Yuzu Spitzna, like a shower gel, just a foam version, and I really like this stuff. It was very nice to use. If I can find a cheap version of this, I would like to buy it, but I have too much shower gel to go through, so I can't buy this at the time being. Then let's move on to the progress. So I have a hand cream here that I have made a ton of progress on, actually. Uh, last time I haven't used it because I used the other one, but 
now I'm down to here so this is going very fast and it is so much nicer to use and to my surprise it's yellow I don't know if you can see it and I like it I like it a lot so I will bring this with me on holiday I don't know where I am with this because I haven't marked it um, but I'm quite sure I'm down to here or something because I have used this a lot for my face and my body because I have gotten a really good tan over the summer when I have been away so I will bring this to holiday as well. I have a new mark for this one and I'm very excited about that because this haven't moved in 3-4 months maybe. Um, so I was up to here when I put it in and now I'm down to here or something. I haven't marked it but trust me it's down to here. Yeah, here. I'm very happy about that one. Um, I don't know what happened. I just used it. <laughs> what? Let's take this face oil. I can't mark this, but it is the Gauss Overnight Primer Oil Essence. Oh, yeah, and this is the Ola's Beauty Fluid Day Normal Dry Combo Moisturizer. I love this stuff for masking. And yeah, this is very, very nice. I use it the day before I need to wear makeup, so that's progress you know oil it is the caramel Jew wild body oil energized therapeutic oil I don't think I have used it since last time but I don't know if I'm going to bring this with me on holiday or not today I use this one it is the Emma Sam cosmetic Ruba body souffle and it is like a thick uh, no not thick body lotion but it is very very nice to use I like it a lot I love the smell Okay, I just told you I had a cold and I'm going to sniff it. I can't smell anything. But I really, really like this stuff. I'm not going to bring this one. But I'm going to bring this one. It is the, the Body Shop Spiced Apple Body Butter because it's smaller and yeah. Um, I think my skin is getting more dry when it's exposed to the sun, basically. So I will use this one more than the other one for next time. Plus it's smaller, so it's easier to travel with, basically. Okay, please stay with me, camera. <laughs> Please. I have the Vita Liberata Luxury Tan Fabulous Self Tanning Tinted Lotion. I'm not going to use this because I have a tan and I'm going to have a tan. So this will get used in September or after. So I'm pretty sure I can get through this at some point, but just not now. I have the Talica Photo Hydra Day Space Specific Hydration Lotion. So I will not touch this before my oil or this is done because I have had those open for longer. I haven't opened this at all. And the same with this one. This hand cream has been from almost the beginning as well. It is the Dalam de Olive Cream Intense Hand Cream. Neither have I opened this one so this will be used when I'm done with this one because I took this one with me first which is dumb but yeah. Then I have the Balance Me Tinted Wonder Eye Cream. I don't know if I like this stuff or not, but it is tinted. I'm going to bring it with me on holiday, so I'm using that every single night. The last skincare item is my cleansing bar. This is the product I tried to talk about in the beginning that I didn't know if I liked anymore because every time I have used this and going to wash it off, I get it into my eyes and it stings and it itches for like 30 seconds or so. Very, very unpleasant. In uh, Milnik, when I was in Czech Republic, I br brought this with me and one of the last nights I tried to use this and I got this eye infection, not infection, but it was red and swollen and I'm pretty sure this caused it. Um, it was dry and so and it lasted for a few days and the th same thing happened today, this morning, and I used this last night and it stung my eyes. So I'm pretty sure it is this one. So I'm going to take a break from it and when I use it again and the same happens, not because I want it to happen again, but if it happens again, I'm going to declutter this or throw it out or something because I don't want to have my eyes stung on the time.
I'm going to blow my nose. Sorry. <laughs> okay, I'm back. I just realized how much of a mess I look like. So I'm sorry about that for the entire video almost. So that is all my skincare. So now we're going to the makeup and I have some progress to show you guys. Uh, not much, but I have some. I'm just a mess because I'm in a hurry because I need to uh, go in an hour or so and I really want this to be edited as well. Start off with the powders. I have this Tease Cosmetics powder and I think I could see them last time, but through the powder now I can see some rings. I can see two rings, so the smaller one and the one around it. And I can almost see the third ring. I'm pretty sure in a few months I can see pan. This lasts forever. It's so hard pressed into the pan that I get a ton of product on my brush, but I can't get through this. Oh, that's kind of frustrating when you really like a powder and you can't see progress, you know? But I can see the wings soon, so that's a good sign. Then I have my Neutral Luxe Bronzer, this is what I use to contour with. You have seen this in my rolling pan project as well. So if you saw that, you know there's no, not that much progress. I am using it, but you don't need much when you're fair like me. And this is quite dark, <laughs> so yeah, let's just see what <laughs> where it takes me. I haven't used this since my last update, maybe twice or three times or so. It is the Imite Lip and Cheek Tint. I really like it, but I just don't use it. It's an extra step in my routine, basically. I haven't used the Manicada Beauty Duo. It is the bronzer and highlighter that I maybe want to use as an eyeshadow. Uh, the highlighter I can use on my face as well, but yeah. I have other stuff to go through. Then I have my Bella Pierre Cosmetics um, Illuminating Bronzer in POD. Yeah. And I have used this uh, a few times as an eyeshadow, but not that you can see progress at all. Oh, I need some medication for my nose. This is awful. Then I have some lip products before I need to go to the nail polish. I have the Tease Cosmetics Heat Wave Ruby uh, Red Lipstick and yeah, I will insert some pictures of the product, the updates and so and so and because I don't have it with me, <laughs> I forgot it. Then I have the Mimi Me Lip Glide Velvet Finish Lip Color in Playful Peach. I really like this product actually for the summertime. So all of these lip products I'm going to take with me on holiday. Then I have my Goss Intense Lip Color in a purple-ish shade. It is the one with the mirror and the light in the cap, you see? So it is very, very nice. I used this in my Panda Palette update, then I wore that one in that video. So I really like that shade actually for summer. I have a Gosh Nail Glitter. I have used this once, you can see this photo. I don't like it. <laughs> I haven't found a method I really like. Um, I need to look it up on YouTube a bit more and play around with it. Um, it is not something that I would love to get more of or anything. I tried to pair it with this Catrice Cosmetics uh, nail lacquer in the very very best. And yeah, I have some small progress to show you here. Not much. I layered these two on top of each other, but I didn't like that at all. I haven't used this nails in Richmond Park Gardens. Okay, my nose is awful. I'm going to end this video in a minute. And then I have the Icona Milano nail polish in white. Um, I don't know what the name is, but I have a small progress here. Not very much, but it is there. I hope I had remembered everything for this update because most of the time I forgot one or two products or something. Um, yeah, 
So that is everything I'm going to work on. I'm not going to add any more in because I don't have any more products to add in. If I'm going to add products in, um, it's going to be products that don't overlap my products I have it in now. And that will be gifts or something I got when I purchased something online. I have some samples of that kind. But I have so much going on in this project that I don't really want to add any more in right now. Maybe in a few months I can add more in if I need to. But yeah, that is basically where I am right now. I hope you enjoyed and I hope you will check out the other ladies down below. They will always be linked down below. Um, I don't know how many updates I can link down below anymore because my box down below is full and I can't add more in. So. Yeah, that's a problem. <laughs> um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed and I hope you t will check out the ladies. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Follow my social media. And yeah, like this video if you enjoyed it. And I will see you next time and take care until then. Bye guys.